village after village washed away, roads, bridges, homes destroyed, crops and livelihoods wiped down. I met many women and men with very little in the best of times or wash in a sea of suffering. Ban Ki-moon attempts to rally the international community as the full extent of the Pakistan crisis becomes clear. The UN Secretary General spoke of a slow-motion tsunami bringing devastation on a vast scale. As many as 20 million people are now said to be in need of shelter. One-fifth of Pakistan, an area the size of England, is now underwater. This emergency session of the world's richest nations was called as the UN attempts to tackle what Ban Ki-moon called one of the greatest tests of global solidarity in our times. Britain's leading the way with the International Development Secretary, Andrew Mitchell, announcing a boost in aid. Britain will double its support to just under $100 million for the emergency phase. The US has also promised to give more, adding a reminder that the stability of one of the world's most politically precarious regions is also at stake.